It's just unbelievable. You know, those kids have just put in a ton of work. They're extremely talented. And the greatest part about it, they're just extremely coachable. They play hard. They're humble. They love the game of basketball. And it's nice to see all the hard work that nobody sees. It's nice to see it pay off for them with, you know, the thousand points means a lot. But if you ask each one of them, you know, going 21-1 and one and winning the league again, that means more to them and they want to make a turn run. So it's, it's nice to see everybody rewarding it. It's, it's a very special moment.
Cameron, since he was at Crawford for two years, he was, you know, he was 0-3 in district championships coming into tonight, and Evan and I were 0-2, and, you know, it was just a chip on our shoulders with all the adversity we've gone through uh, this offseason, losing a couple guys, but, you know, we all, we just believe, and we kept believing and believing and believing and getting better every day and adjusting to how we're going to play without a few guys, and, you know, going to BG to play the Stro is going to be a lot of fun, and, you know, we're not done yet. You know, there's not very many teams that can say they won the last game in the state of Ohio for boys basketball. And 24 in a row, pretty incredible, and we're only the third team in uh, upper history to make it to a regional. So we were really good when we had all the guys, really, really good. We were really on a roll, and we've got a lot of memories, a lot of great memories. Probably the greatest team I've ever coached. Everybody loves each other, everybody fights for each other, and when you got good team chemistry, you can overcome a lot of things.